Hello everyone welcome to back my channel I hope everyone is having a wonderful day before starting the video please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up a Julie and Todd Crisley may have something to gain from their time behind bars. For the reason that the Crisley Knows Best alums have reportedly started writing their memoirs, as revealed by their daughter Savannah. On the other hand, Todd and Julie have kept in contact via email. Find out everything that happened to them after their reality TV days below. During her parents' time behind bars, Savannah Crisley just shared some wisdom with her dad, Todd, and mom, Julie. Additionally, she mentioned that the two had been granted email rights, enabling them to communicate via that medium. In 2017, the patriarch and matriarch of Crisley Knows Best were found guilty on accusations of tax evasion and bank fraud, as reported by TV Insider, nevertheless, Julie and Todd were initially sentenced to 19 years in prison together. And in January, Todd commenced serving his 12-year term at the federal prison camp Pensacola in Florida. Concurrently, Julie began serving her 7-year term at the Federal Medical Center in Lexington, Kentucky. Documenting every little thing that goes on keeps the couple busy, according to Savannah, who is the couple's daughter. They might be working on books, they might, she joked. Who can say for sure? But Savannah and her brother Chase Crisley have also spoken out against what they see as inhumane prison circumstances, for example, Savannah detailed the incident where the ice machines were closed and the air conditioning was turned off by allegedly corrupt jail guards in the midst of a 100-degree heat wave. Savannah also mentioned that she calls her parents several times a day. She did, however, note that since her parents' January prison report, they had not had a face-to-face -face conversation. Still, they communicate via email. However, Savannah asserted that her parents similarly struggle with letter recognition, she made the accusation that inmates were holding their letters, which she described as unfortunate. She further asserted that some incarcerated individuals get lost. People outside of prison don't seem to care to hear their stories, Savannah added, there have been sentencing reductions for Todd and Julie since their first convictions. For instance, according to the federal prison records kept by FBC Pensacola, the grandfather of Crisley Knows Best is scheduled to be released on January 22, 2033. This resulted in a roughly two-year reduction to his prison sentence. The revised prison terms were beneficial to Julie as well. The Crisley Knows Best matriarch will be released on October 19, 2028, according to records for FMC Lexington. And her initial seven-year term was only seven years and 15 months short of that date, provide your opinion. What are your thoughts on the idea that Julie and Todd Crisley were given permission to communicate via email while incarcerated? Would you purchase the tell-all memoirs written by the Crisley Knows Best alums? Once you've had your say, be sure to return to our site for additional updates on reality TV. Thanks for watching this video and please subscribe our America People News YouTube channel for more update news.